Space News, a NASA rover launched to Mars five years ago, has now discovered what the space agency calls the clearest sign yet of ancient life on Mars. This is cool. Jenna Webster introduces us to the Purdue professor who's helping lead the way in that discovery. College students are just starting out in the world, learning where life and career dreams may take them. But one professor never imagined where his would lead him. I never expected to go into exploring Mars, but here I am in Indiana exploring Mars. Roger Weens is a professor of planetary science at Purdue. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Also the principal investigator. There it is. Using this guy, Perseverance Rover, to explore Mars with NASA. So there is uh, online software that we do to actually look at where the rover is on Mars. So we get the pictures from, you could say like out the windshield effectively, and then we use those pictures to pick the rocks. He's in charge of the SuperCam instrument on top of the one ton rover. We'll see what kind of rocks people want to hit. The SuperCam fires a pulse razor to help determine the mineral and chemical composition of the rock. We uh, were in a deep river valley and that river valley uh, had some very interesting rocks. They have something that I've seen in rocks out west in the U.S. Uh, called reduction spots. Those reduction spots were found here in the Jezero Crater. Now scientists say they may have been made by ancient life, possibly billions of years ago. What are we really seeing here? And then we started putting together the data from more than one instrument. And that's when we started to realize, hey, this is a really special place. It's a special place he can see right from his office desk, though he can only tell us what he's seeing now. And at the moment, we're, the rover's in an area on the edge of the crater where we're finding uh, some really ancient rocks that were like, uh, landed here after a big impact. 140 million miles away doesn't seem so far when new discoveries are happening right here in Indiana. From where the rover is now? In West Lafayette or on Mars. Jenna Webster, 13 News. <laughs> Jenna says the professor has worked with NASA for 35 years. And while it's never what he expected, he says he's been a Mars explorer since he was 11 Aww. years old. He and his brother used to look at the planet through a telescope and sketch its features. So how very fitting wow. that he's doing that now. Yeah, that he can pursue his passion as That's a amazing. profession. That's mm -hmm. very, very, very cool. A lesson to all of us. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. It <laughs>